So in preparation for my week trip to Boston, uh, what I'm doing right now is just packing up my toolkit. I got a really good comment on one of the videos not too long ago asking me what do I do um, for packing up or planning for trips whenever I'm going out of town. Now obviously this looks like a big mess. Uh, I have two toolkits that I'm going to try to combine into my big yellow toolkit as you can see. Uh, some of the equipment that I, I work on four pieces of equipment. But going up to Boston, I'm gonna be working on two pieces of equipment. This is gonna be a Prodigy and a Max Quant. Now, you probably don't know a lot about this, but if you are really interested in knowing those pieces of equipment, you can kind of look those up. I don't wanna go into too much detail as far as that part. But uh, one of the things that I try to do is I try to combine everything as I possibly can, but I still have to make sure that I have all the necessary tools that way, when I'm at a customer site, I'm prepared and ready for whatever maintenance or repair I need to do. So right now, what I'm doing is I'm condensing all of my maintenance parts as well as repair parts that I'm gonna need for the week. Now, one of the things I do like to do, obviously the parts that I get come in sometimes big boxes. I'll take them out, make sure they're still in their packaging, make sure there's no water or anything getting in there. But I'll, for example, we'll get these uh, syringes so they come in this big of a box so instead of having this big box taking up so much space in my toolkit where i'm struggling for space i'm going to take that syringe out and i'm actually going to save the um the tag information because i definitely need this one of the things i will do is take that tag um take it out of this packaging and then i'm going to tape it I have a separate little bag here that I put them all in. Um, obviously it is glass, so I do have to worry about it possibly breaking, but I'm pretty careful for the most part with my stuff and making sure the care of my maintenance parts are well taken care of. So this is just a good way to save space and make sure everything fits in my toolkit. You can kind of see what I have going on here. Um, we have these other parts here. Also, these are uh, paw filters that we have, they come in these boxes here. So instead of keeping it in this box where it's gonna take up a lot of space, real estate, I need all the real estate I can get for my toolkit. This is just gonna be a good way to save some space. So all I'll do is to make sure I don't um, lose which part belongs to what uh, tag, I'm gonna tape it on there. So this is what I'm doing now. I have a few more left that I need to do and I'll actually show you how much space I'm gonna be able to save. So this is four. Four of them will take about this much space. Whereas I can condense and I have several of them already in here and then bam. So I think this is a much better option for anyone that's like traveling. Um, the main thing is whenever you are packing your bag, just make sure you don't underpack. You know, you don't want to get to a customer site and you're missing parts that you need because you wanted to, you know, cram everything into one. So completely packed up. This is what my toolkit looks like for a Prodigy as well as a Max Quant. Uh, PMs that, are gonna, that I'm going to be doing. Now I'm going to be doing about, I think, uh, maybe six or seven PMs this week. I'm trying to do about two a day. I think the last day I have to do three. So we'll see how that goes. I always try to knock on wood in case anything might go array. But this is what my full toolkit looks like. It's stuffed to the brim. Um, as I am using up these maintenance parts, things are gonna start to dwindle down, which is good. But this is my full toolkit leaving out from home. And let me tell you this, boy, is this thing heavy. Um, usually uh, this toolkit, it's about, I don't know, a little bit over 50 pounds, but flying wise, I think I might be closer to 70. So we'll find out tomorrow uh what my weight actually is luckily um with united i have enough pool or points account wise to where i can 
Um, I have up to like, I don't know, maybe like four or five free check bags or something. Uh, even like with weight, if stuff is overweight, doesn't matter. Um, so at least that's good. So if you're a field service engineer, you don't have an airline that you use consistently, use one, create an account with them. That way you can be like me and you can check your bags for free, even if they're overweight. So along with packing my toolkit, uh, as well as clothes that I'm going to need for the time being, I'm also going to pack some electronics, uh, mainly my camera. Um, I have my GoPro that I'm going to be using for my POV, uh, just mainly electronics that I'm going to be using just to kind of shoot and record videos. I also have my work laptop, personal laptop, iPad for movies, work, etc. So all that's going to get packed up in my book bag as well. So it's Monday morning, uh, still dark outside as you guys just saw. Uh, first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to be traveling today. So first thing I'm going to do is try to get a little workout in. This is what I'm doing right now. After I work out, shower, eat, same kind of routine that you guys previously saw in one of the other videos uh, for my travel days. So about to just do it and then you guys can tag along with me. So let's get it. So the next thing after doing a little bit of uh, just lifting, uh, just light, and then um, just using my own body weight, I'm gonna do a little bit of cardio. So join me on this run. So let's get it. So after doing my cardio, uh, gonna take my little pooper here sky for a little walk uh, I kind of like to do this because one more cardio and two I don't know I just like being outside I've said this before but just gets me a little bit of time to just think uh, that's why I kind of like walking so here's her time to stretch her legs I stretch my legs and it's a win-win all around sky So I just made it to Boston at the airport. Um, I'm probably gonna end the video here. I was editing a video, the garden video that I was supposed to post yesterday, but it ended up being 20 minutes. Uh, my laptop, I was trying to edit it. It wasn't working out so well. So I'm gonna just section off this video, end it here. I'm gonna pick up uh, tomorrow probably just recording uh, if I have time hopefully and then we'll go from there hopefully you guys enjoyed um, if you did let me know what you think in the comments below if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you subscribe hit the like button and if you found this video at all informational make sure you share with someone else that might find it useful with that said I'll catch you on the next one